What's going on guys? It's the AI guy and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to go over installing OpenCV on Windows for Python. For those of you who aren't familiar with OpenCV, I'll just give a brief overview of it. So OpenCV or Open Source Computer Vision is a library for computer vision and machine learning that contains over 2,500 optimized algorithms. So basically, it's a massive library of functions used on images and videos that allow you to accelerate your use of computer vision through classic and state-of-the-art algorithms that you don't have to hand code yourself. It's most popularly, popularly used for facial detection, identifying objects within images or videos, tracking camera movements, and a bunch more. It's used by massive tech companies all over the industry, like Google, Microsoft, Intel, IBM, Sony, and many, many more. And today I'm gonna to show you how to install it on your machine. In today's video, we are going to pip install OpenCV for Python, then import CV2 and print its version to verify that we've installed and fetched OpenCV properly. And I'm gonna show you how to do this in both the command prompt and Python script to give you a little flexibility. So let's get right into the video. If you're new to my channel, feel free to hit the like and subscribe button. It would mean a lot to me. I post content like this weekly. So I hope you enjoy it. Let's get into it. So first things first, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and open up a command prompt. So go around to your type to search and type in command prompt, open it up. And this, I will mention that there are is a prerequisite for this tutorial. You do have to have Python already installed. So if you don't have Python installed, hop over on over to my previous video on how to set up a machine learning and AI environment where I walk through installing Python and Visual Studio Code, and then come back here. So if you do have Python already installed, this is a very simple tutorial. First things first is we're gonna wanna pip install OpenCV for Python. So just type in pip install OpenCV-Python. And that's gonna go ahead and collect Python. As you can see, it also looks for a prerequisite in NumPy. So if you don't already have NumPy, it'll actually install NumPy as well for you. So perfect, I've got OpenCV Python version 4.1.1.26. So now I can go ahead and verify that that is indeed installed on my machine. So what you're gonna do is just go ahead and type Python. So now it opens up your Python version and you can start to program in Python. So you're just gonna go import CV2, which is a version of uh, OpenCV, enter. And it's gonna go ahead and import it. And if you got an error here, it means I did not install correctly since it went to a new line and did no, no error. I'm gonna to check to see if it installed correctly. So I'm going to go to print CV2 dot underscore underscore version underscore underscore close bracket. And if that failed and you got an error, it would give you a warning or an error message. But since I've successfully installed OpenCV, it prints my version 4.1.1, which I know to be correct. So it's as simple as that for the command prompt. And now let me hop over to my Visual Studio code and show you how to do it exactly the same way in a Python script. So for the second way of completing this tutorial in a code editor, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and open your code editor. I'm using VS Code, because I like it because it's lightweight. So you're gonna to wanna to just create a file. I've created mine, opencvtutorial.py. It's gonna to have to be a .py, so that can be a Python script and we can run it. And then you're gonna to wanna to open up a terminal. So click on terminal, new terminal. And then you're gonna go ahead and do the exact same command as before. pip install opencv-python. It's gonna go ahead and collect it. It gets the same version, 4.1.1. So now we can go back into our code and do our two lines, import CV2 and print CV2 dot underscore underscore version, underscore underscore. You're gonna go ahead and save and then just right click on the screen and go run Python file and terminal. And you're gonna go ahead and see that it prints 4.1.1. So this quick version check of CV2 is enough to verify that it is correctly pip installed. 
and that you can now go ahead and start using one of those 2500 algorithms that OpenCV has within it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. That's all for today. If you want to see more videos, go ahead and like this video, smash that like button. It's greatly appreciated. And I'll see you guys next time.